a final stand, a shouting cry. All the wrongs now turn to right. So fight the past, take back the night, and call upon the torch tonight to bring out all the Hey there guys and welcome back to part 8 of my Let's Play series of The Sims 3 Roaring Heights. I've actually done quite a bit of stuff off camera for this part. If you had watched part 7 you would have known that I was having some problems with the fixer upper car. Not anymore. Let's go shopping in our very own fixer upper car. Where can we go shopping? Let's go here to the bookstore. I really just want to show off this car quickly since it took so much effort getting it um, actually working in my game. I had to reinstall pretty much all my custom content, had to remove it and replace it. So we are back to where we were and we're just going to pause it and look at it just quickly. How friggin' flash does that look? It's a boss car. That is so cool. What I've actually done is quite a few days have passed in the game. So Ty is almost ready to age up and Tegan is actually going to age up today. So what we're going to be doing this part is we're going to be throwing Tegan a party for her and some of her friends. But you'll notice that our money is quite a bit higher than it was before. That is because we have made... Oh, the taxi just hit us. <laughs> That is because we have made quite a few of these fixer-upper cars before. Uh, Ty's handiness skill, or writing skill is level 7, handiness is level 5, and Tegan's is level 4, which has moved up quite a bit from where they were before because I had been doing it off-camera. So here we are at the shopping centre. I just really wanted to um, show off the new car before we move into our new lot. So I've gone back to the original hair for Tegan as well. Let's buy as a celebratory birthday gift for Tegan. Let's buy a cyber skateboarding. So we'll buy that for five bucks, which is worth it. So let's check in on Tegan. Oh, we got some money. So we got some royalties from all our books. The bling ring failed. IT was our best so far. So we've written five books so far and we have plenty more to come because we're about to end our young adult lifestyle and move into the adult lifestyle which means we're gonna have to start acting a little bit more grown up but we're doing that already pretty much so what we are going to be doing is we are going to be moving into our new house so to show you this on the lot so here is our new house I have built this house and I've built it to resemble the house that we are currently in but more modern and with a huge backyard that we can add to as we get better. All the trees are in the way blocking my beautiful screenshots. But so that's what we are going to be doing right now. So I'm going to pop into edit town so I'll see you guys when we move into our new house. Okay, so we're back and we're about to purchase the house. As you can see, our household funds are 90000 and this is going to cost us $79,933. So we're going to purchase that and then we're going to return to the game. So we are going to, of course, choose the Pengal household, which is Ty's last name, which may be Tegan's last name before too long. <laughs> Lots of plans for this family. So this house is entirely unfurnished. So at the moment we have $10,000 to furnish it. So I'm going to go furnish this now and I'm going to show it as a speed build. So I'll check back in you, on you guys in about a minute.
it's time to take back the night. So I hope you enjoyed that speed build. We are back. Give it go, good. So I'm just actually quickly going to change this little fence. Actually, that gave us so much money. I think I might just, for the moment, while I'm trying to have enough money for Tegan's party, I'm actually gonna just remove that entirely because we've just gained a thousand dollars. And we do need, we need to have a little area here for Tegan's party, just so we can have some fun stuff to do. So, what can we have? We can have something that everyone can do. How about, we could have a bonfire. Or a snow cone card, or a spa. Zoom sweep area, oh that'd be awesome. Let's get a slide, make it blue, and then I'm also going to get the idea that I had first, which was this, and we need cheap, cheap, cheap chairs, because we don't have all that much money. So that should be plenty, and some food, what are we going to have food? Uh, let's have this out here. Again, guys, I'm just doing this really quite basically f because it's Tegan's party and we'll eventually get rid of this stuff once um, we have a little bit more money. Um, but now we have to scrape by with the bare necessities, which is okay. It's kind of fun doing it that way. Ooh, we need a tiny bit more money. What can I get rid of? We don't need that many chairs. How much is the tree? $183. The tree is gone. Done. Okay, we now have a grill. And I'm going to bring this a little bit closer to the grill as well. Okay, cool. Can I just, how much is it going to cost to do that? Not too much. I'd like to outline it as well. Um... I'm not even going to keep this, but I want to out. I want to make it look as nice as possible. Whoops. Ooh. I think if I delete another chair, I'll have enough money. Cool. Done. There. Perfect. Happy. Now we have everything we need to throw Tegan's party. So our moods are pretty good. So we're going to have Tegan get on her phone. And let's throw a party. So let's find Tegan, put the walls down, and let's see what she does with her friends. Hey, guys. Okay, so... Mmm, which ones are we going to get? Ty's friend. Tegan's friends. We need Tegan's friend, not Ty's friend. Uh, you can invite Ty's friend. Little kid can come. I always invite more people to parties than I think we should. Um, I don't want, it's a house party, feast party, costume party. Ooh, I'd love a bonfire party, but let's just have a house party. So, just casual. Could have swimwear. We'll have plenty more parties in the future, but let's just do it like this. So the party's going to start at 3am, which is not far away. 
So hopefully everyone can come and we can have a great birthday party for Tegan. I also have forgotten the birthday cake, the most important thing, and I do not have enough money for it, of course. So, what? Oh, oh yeah, 20 bucks. Okay. Can it go on top of here? It can go on the floor. I think that's because I have move objects on. Let's turn that off quickly and see if it works the same because I want it to work. Nah, didn't think it would. Okay, so we're going to need to buy a little... Oh, we can afford that. But now we probably can't afford the cake. Yes! No, we need five more bucks. Um... Is so there anything we bought upstairs that we don't really need? There. Wow, okay, we've saved a bit of money. We will get all this stuff back, don't you worry. Must be pay placed on a surface with a slot. It's like a counter. Okay. What if I grab the counter here? Oops, I didn't mean to grab the light. Still have enough money, which is great. Got to get this done. Yes! Sweet! Okay, we're in business. And we have $208 to spend if we need it. So, we're going to have Ty just check out some of these stuff. So, here's our little bathroom. I'm going to put the walls up just quickly. So, it's quite nice. Ruby red and white textures. Obviously, as we get more money, I am going to put more effort into the creator style features of this house as well as the um, normal features of this house. So we're going to have Tegan, we can have her blow out the candles and age up, but we're not going to do that of course. So we're going to light the bonfire and hopefully some people will come. We're going to have Ty actually, we don't want to join, oh people are here, people are here. The first guests have arrived and it's time to start the party. To make it a success, make sure everyone is having a good time. Okay, so let's make sure we have Ty... Oops, fuck. No, we want to greet everyone. Friendly introduction. <laughs> we don't want that to happen, no. Where's Tegan? Where's Tegan? Hopefully no one's left. Please, no one's left. Ooh, so she's going to use our stuff, so we are going to friendly introduction. So who, ooh, ooh, this guy, this guy's creeping up on people. Susu. Ooh, did she bring something? She brought some food for us. What's her name? Louise. What a legend, Louise. You're awesome. And she's running away. Okay, so... So let's friendly ask a pillow fight, because why not? So Tegan's going to funny show video, funny, make silly face, friendly, enthuse about cats. Take cell phone photo. Why would we take a cell phone photo of some random? Just have the pillow fight, guys. You guys do not know how to pillow fight. Oh, and we're a level two celebrity. Whoops. Everyone's crowded over here. Oh, don't strangle yourself, please. Cool, at least they're showing stuff. So where is Tegan? Tegan needs to go greet some of the other guests. So how about we have her... We don't want to upgrade to fireproof. 
Why? We, oh, we don't have enough room. So we're going to serve this meal. Everyone. So then everyone's having a good time. Everyone's getting some food. I'm always happier at parties when we have food. You'll notice a lot of these sims are Roaring Heights sims with all the new hats and stuff like that. So everyone's coming along to get some of the food that Louise brought, the legend Louise. And I think we're all going to go sit out near the bonfire. Ooh, chairs just spawned there. That's interesting. This can connect up here. I didn't know that. I didn't know chairs were going to spawn. Otherwise, I would have just saved money. That's a waste of my money. You guys should have told me that. <laughs> By which I mean Ty and Tegan. Ty and Tegan, you need to need to work on your communication skills with me. Hey, there's plenty of other chairs. Good. Everyone enjoy themselves. Might actually get a sink out here. Um, oh, of course I want a bathroom. So sink, and we'll just get a cheap one. So it's almost time. Let's roast a marshmallow. Ooh. No, 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 don't argue, don't argue, no. Ask about day. We don't want anyone arguing. We don't want anyone having problems. We want it all to be a nice, nice time for Tegan. Ask about game. Do all the guy stuff. Celebrity gossip. He's actually a celebrity. Complain about dirty dishes. Share secret. You could do that. So let's have So we're going to have Tegan blow out the candles before everyone leaves Because it is getting late and we did start the party early Oh come on guys, come on guys, everyone should Everyone has to go watch Oh we have a little kid So Tegan is celebrating her birthday in her underwear, of course. I'm happy for you, Tegan. You've made it this far in life, and I'm really proud of what you've achieved so far. I hope you grow up still looking hot. <laughs> Everyone's having a good time. I love Sims birthdays. Tegan is now a fully mature, is now a fully mature, at, oh, okay, at least some of the time, adult, she'll really need to think about establishing herself in her career and family life while she still has time. And her hairstyle is ruined. Ooh, Tegan's having a midlife crisis already, generations. So everyone's going to grab some cake, and we're all going to join each other here. I think this was a pretty successful party. We got cake and food. Nothing wrong with that. Ty's about to grow up as well, so we're going to have to have a party for him next episode as well. But everyone seemed to enjoy themselves, so Ty got to have some of his friends, and we're going to have Tegan as a... Thing for oh we need a mirror that's what we need perfect so as a celebratory um, thing for growing up we're gonna have Tegan change her appearance because that hairstyle looks absolutely awful so we're gonna have a hair change I really like the um, the color of her hair I think we're just gonna stick with her natural one. I'm gonna keep that. Sweet. And we'll be back in just a sec. Okay, so 
I have to leave now, but thanks for inviting me. So we're going to pretty much end the party now. So ask everyone to leave. Or can we just end the party as like... few people are still here, it's just about winding up. Um, yeah, just let's ask everyone to leave. I think that'll end the party. At least I think so, huh? I really like the water slides, one of my favourite things from The Sims 3, and it's been around since Generations, which is quite a while ago, actually. Impress group marks. I think it's time to go, she had fun. Hey, nice party over to go though. Cool. So I hope that ends the party otherwise. Oh, hot wings. What is that? Oh my god. Why did we not eat that? Why did we not eat that? Tegan's party was a modest success. The guests feel good about having attended. So we did all right for being poor. <laughs> so I think that's about it for this episode as we have age Tegan up to... An adult, she has 21 days until she is an elder, and Ty has two days left as a young adult. We have moved into our beautiful new modern house, which is one more story higher. I really like this house, and we are going to be continuing with it next time. If you guys like this episode, please give it a thumbs up. It really does help me out. And also, please make sure that you answer the comment question which is on the screen now and i will see you guys next time for another sims 3 let's play bye guys